Welcome to the Cadence Watch You So at Hardware Weekend. Today we will look at a basic introduction to MOSFET and its characterization in Virtuoso. The metal oxide semiconductor field effect transistor, also known as MOSFET, is a semiconductor device that is widely used for switching purposes and amplification of signals in electronic devices. A MOSFET is either a core or an integrated circuit where it is designed and fabricated in a single chip because the device is available in very small sizes. The introduction of the MOSFET device has brought a change in the domain of switching in electronics. Let us go with a short explanation for this concept. A MOSFET is a four terminal device having source, gate, drain and body terminals. In general, the body of the MOSFET is in connection with the source terminal thus forming a three terminal device such as the field effect transistor. MOSFET is generally considered as a transistor and is employed in both analog and digital circuits. The width of the channel is controlled by the voltage of an electrode which is called the gate and it is located in between the source and the drain. It is insulated from the channel near an extremely thin layer of metal oxide. The main principle of the MOSFET device is to be able to control the voltage and current flow between the source and drain terminals. It works almost like a switch and the functionality of this device is based on the MOS capacitor. The semiconductor surface at the below oxide layer which is located between the source and drain terminal can be inverted from p-type to n-type by the application of either a positive or negative gate voltage respectively. When we apply a repulsive force with a positive gate voltage, then the holes present beneath the oxide layer are pushed downward with the substrate. The depletion region is populated by the bound negative charges which are associated with the acceptor atoms. When electrons are reached, a channel is developed. The positive voltage also attracts electrons from the n plus source and drain regions. Now if a voltage is applied between the drain and the source, the current flows freely between the source and drain and the gate voltage controls the electrons in the channel. Instead of the positive voltage, if we apply a negative voltage, a whole channel will be formed under the oxide layer. The drain characteristics of a MOSFET are drawn between the drain current ID and the drain source voltage VDS. When VDS is increased, the drain current ID should increase, but due to the applied VGS, the drain current is controlled at a certain level. Hence, the gate current controls the output drain current. Virtuoso makes circuit analysis so much easier. Choose your library, select the cell like PMOS or NMOS and set the parameters as width and height. Place your components, make wire connections and connect your signal pins. Now save your circuit. Once you're done with your circuit, launch ADEL analysis window. Virtuoso allows a wide range of options like transient, DC, AC, noise and a lot more. For instance, let us do a DC analysis. We start with setting design variables and DC sweep range. Now select the signal pins you want to visualize on the waveform viewer. We're all set and here we have our first ID versus VDS graph. Tune in to pip install Virtuoso at EA and Hang for installation and join us on the 12th at 10.30 am.